What's up guys, it's Rosie, and do you remember the dream? I mean, you may know him as a performer, but did you know that he also written songs like Umbrella and Single Ladies? I mean, a man who writes with a woman's perspective? I'm not gonna lie, he has kind of like an evil genius mind, and he knows way too much about us girls. Well, he has a new album coming out in May, and my fellow MC Now host Rodney had the chance to talk to him about it. So it's Rodney Rakai here, I'm here with the Mr. Do It All, The Dream. Now, Dream, what's the one thing that, that you would say you're most proud of? Is it the, the writing? Is it the singing? Is it the, the being a record exec? What's the thing that you think you, you, you hang your hat on the most? Um, I think just more so, it's probably the writing. I think I hang my hang my hat on that. You have the foreplay coming out soon in May, if I'm not mistaken, correct? Yeah, May 28th, foreplay is out. All right, so what record are you most excited about right now on the foreplay? It's the actual record foreplay. <laughs> I'm pretty excited about that. I'm really, really, really freaking amped. Cool, cool. So, hip hop is is the ish to me. I love hip hop. I, I think that hip hop is the epitome of black music. So, was there a defining moment in your life when you when you just said I, I love hip hop? I don't think you have a moment where you love hip hop if you're already in, in, engulfed in the culture. So, I don't I don't really think of hip hop as something outside of myself. Okay. Because I was basically born in it. It's not even a thought of putting it in a box to say that you know like. I love hip hop because it's just like, you know, I love me and I think that I'm hip hop, so. You can check out some tracks from The Dream on our hip hop and R&B music channel. Now, do you guys remember this? Oh, I love that song. And Handsome may no longer be the teen heartthrobs they were in the 90s, but they've been steadily making music since those days. You know they have a new album? Their ninth. Could you believe that? It's called Anthem, and they're releasing it on their own label. Their first single, Get the Girl Back, was just released, and Get the Girl Back, that pretty much uh, cuts to the chase, right? So they talked to MC all about what's going on right now for them. When we started off, we heard some of the best bands in the world. We heard classic rock and roll music, soul music, and that made a huge impression on us, and honestly, We've spent the last 20 years really trying to capture the things that we love most about, you know, so much of that great pop music. And yeah. um, I think the thing that's changed the most is really just our ability to execute those things fully. You know, I think... I and think without, lot, with, and, and, and in more of a kind of a style that is kind of more uniquely ours in a different way, too, as well, we've kind of gone I mean, I just, I, I think a lot of times, you know, you know, I've heard music the same way, I feel like, since I was... 10, you know, like yeah. it's all there. It's just a question of your ability to actually take that and fully put it on onto a recording. Mm -hmm. And I think now when we walk into a room, you know, we very quickly, the three of us play together and it has a sound. It, it sounds uh, closer to what we you always imagine it sounding like. It's got a little more edge, it's a little more organic than the very first record. Yeah. But it's at its core, I think it it's it has a um, a sensibility that's always been the same. It's about writing good pop songs, good melody, and something that hopefully you listen to and it stands the test of time. I think the Jonas Brothers totally took their formula, but hey, three hot brothers in a band seems to work for you ladies, right? You can check out Hanson and our Pop Hits music channel. Now, before we go, we have yet another tweet of the week. It comes from SwiftyMan1989, and he says, I'm a huge fan of listening to music on Music Choice every day because music is my life and my passion. Smiley face, heart. It's my life and my passion too, you know. And for that, you get a prize. Thank you so much for watching MC Now. I'm your host, Rosie, and do not forget to follow us on Twitter and Facebook. MC.